Welcome to this ZenWorks demonstration video. In this video, we will demonstrate how to use the dashboard feature to get a visual representation of the data in your zone, to monitor vital system statuses, and to take the required actions to resolve any concerns. Let's consider a scenario where Roger, a ZenWorks system administrator, wants to view the details of all workstations in his zone that have not contacted the server for the last 30 days. Roger can achieve this task by using the device last contact dashlet, which is one of the default dashlets. To access the dashlet, Roger clicks devices, dashboard, and then the device last contact dashlet. The device last contact dashlet provides a visual representation of all the devices available in the management zone, which are grouped based on their server last contact time. To view the data in a bar chart format, Roger clicks the chart type icon and selects bar chart. In like manner, he can also change the chart type to the donut format. Since Roger only wants to view the last contact time of workstations, in the filter panel, he first selects workstations as the device type. To view details of workstations that did not contact the server for 30 days, Roger clicks the time filter tab in the time period values dropdown, selects more than 30 days, clears the other selected time filters, and then clicks Apply. Roger can now identify the workstations that have not contacted the server for the last 30 days. To resolve this issue, he decides to run the Refresh Quick task for these devices. He can also click the device to view additional device details. To navigate back to the dashboard, he clicks the Back to Dashboard link. For easy access, Roger can save the modified dashlet using the Save As option. He can also export the dashlet grid data by selecting the Export as CSV option. Based on Roger's daily operations, he can unpin or pin the required dashlets to the dashboard canvas. To unpin a dashlet, Roger clicks the Pin to icon and clears the dashboard option from which he wants to hide the dashlet. At any point, if Roger wants to pin the dashlet back to the dashboard, he needs to click the plus icon and select the required dashlet. Custom dashlets are available in the Save tab. When the data is no longer required, Roger can delete the dashlet by clicking the Delete icon on the custom dashlet. Default dashlets cannot be deleted. For more information on the dashboard feature, refer to the help or online documentation. Thanks for watching.